And in Baltimore County, police are investigating a deadly hit and run after a 67 year old man was struck Thursday off Reisterstown Road. Now his family is trying to honor their loved one and find answers surrounding his death. Annie Rose Ramos spoke to them earlier today. Annie Rose. Rachel, a tough day for the Scram family who left flowers memorializing their loved one, who they describe as a veteran, someone struggling with PTSD, who was struck and killed right here on this block. A humble cross memorializing 67 year old Willard Scram, a son's flowers, a daughter's wreath. And I just want them to see this and remember how special of a person he was. A veteran who lost his life Thursday after he was struck and killed off Hammershire and Reister Sound Roads. But we just want to know. We don't know what happened. Baltimore County police say they were first notified of someone yelling in the middle of the street. Minutes later, police got a second call saying Scram was lying next to the curb. We are wondering at this point if he was struck by another vehicle previous to the one that was reported to us that caused him to lay down on the street where he was then struck again, possibly. It's haunting to think about him being laid here and what happened to him. Scram was transported to Sinai Hospital where he later died. Just to know that my dad's not there anymore, I'll never be able to hear his voice anymore. Police say the driver who struck him was behind the wheel of a brown or tan passenger vehicle. Somebody knows how this happened. And the family is now asking for the public's help to help give them the funeral that they say their loved one wanted and deserved as a veteran. They now have a GoFundMe page that we have listed on our website. So head to WJZ.com for more information. Reporting live, I'm Annie Rose Ramos for WJZ.